There's a secret pyramid in North Dakota you probably never heard of, and I didn't before this. A pyramid in the middle of nowhere built to track the end of the world. What is this about? This is a pyramid you probably never heard of, and it's located in Cavalier County, North Dakota, representing a point of collision of two worlds in a huge radar that has a the mystery the mysterious shape of a pyramid, but to face a devastating attack of Soviet missiles during the Cold War. But some believe that this facility has a far bigger purpose, one that could other uh, could otherworldly meanings have. Many ufologists and researchers have questioned the particular shape of this complex, why it was built in a pyramidal shape. And why does it seem to resemble the pyramids ancient people built thousands of years ago in Egypt, America, Asia, and elsewhere? What possible connection does this facility have with these ancient wonders? And could it be possible that this pyramid, built in modern times, proves theory supporting that the ancients did not build their pyramids as tombs and monuments, but as structures with a far greater purpose? The Library of Congress in Washington, D.C. has published the photos of the construction of a military missile base with a pyramidal form, and some believe that its capabilities go far beyond its original purpose, defend against a Soviet aggression. And you'll see many pictures here in the article. The purpose of uh, now the Library of Congress uh, in Washington, D.C. has published photos and drawings of the military complex built in the state of North Dakota back in 1975. In the photos taken by photographer Benjamin Halpern for the U.S. government, the various shapes of building appear to be very similar to the Mexican pyramid of Kukulkan in the archaeological complex of Chichen Itza. The purpose of this radar pyramid was it to, uh, to detect and intercept ballistic missile launched by the Soviet Union that could threaten the United States. This high-tech radar base was equipped with 30 interceptor missiles, LIM-49A Spartan, and 16 short-range missiles which could destroy incoming threats such as missiles to U.S. soil. The military believed that this new complex would provide safety and a new and advanced way to eliminate a threat of a nuclear missile strikes uh, from the USSR due to its capability of intercepting enemy missiles before reaching U.S. soil in the atmosphere. Thanks to the radars located on each of the sides, the pyramid provides a 360-degree coverage and was able to detect intercontinental missiles at a distance of 1,100 kilometers and intercept them before re-entry. The Russians did not wait long and built a Soviet A-35 system, which defended Moscow and nearby missile fields. It's believed that an updated version of this defense system a-135 version is still in operation today. The interior of the pyramid is just like the exterior. Amazing housing, several underground bases where the control room and monetary systems were located. All of those rooms were connected to a network of powerful radars across U.S. soil. It is a construction straight out of the Star Wars movie, but its particular design and shape has awakened the interest of ufologists that have come to question its purpose. Was it built to intercept intercontinental missiles, or was the construction of this pyramid in North Dakota of an otherworldly purpose? These wonderful photographs and pharaonic buildings that has been lost in time, something that has captured the interest of researchers and science fiction writers alike, yet it's a pyramid that most of us have never heard of. According to many today, not a single human being can be seen for miles around the complex, and official statements are that the facility is completely abandoned, looking like a post-apocalyptic science fiction movie scene. Out of the hundreds of shapes the builders could have used to construct their radar station, why was the pyramidal shape used? According to many theorists and ufologists, it has a deep connection to the history of mankind and the origins of humanity, not only was this complex facility built as a defense station, ufologists believe it to be a secret facility that the images above are only the tip of the underground iceberg of. This high-tech station 
was closed officially only four months after being opened. Oh, isn't that strange? Why build it if you close it four months later? Reports as to why the station that cost millions of dollars closed only after, after only being operated for four months is something that has yet to be ex explained. Some believe it was closed because the station was proven to be ineffective. Others believe that the cost of maintaining it were simply too high. But there are also those who believe that the station has not been closed and that it is still in operation today, not as a defensive complex, but rather as a facility similar to Dolce Base. Ufologists state that the government should not have thrown away such a complex base worth millions of dollars. They believe that the futuristic pyramid located in North Dakota is a place of extreme importance even today and state that strange sightings have been reported in North Dakota of unidentified flying objects are closely connected to this research facility, quote unquote. Perhaps the truth about the secret pyramid and its purpose are something that will, will be kept in secrecy, but many questions that uh, have been raised throughout the years as to why a pyramid and why it resembles many other ancient pyramids is something many would like to know the answer of. And this is on Collector Spark. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Patreon accounts. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.